Now this right here is my ebook that you guys can get for free and when you open up the ebook you're going to see all these different style thumbnails that I've taken from YouTube and at the top you will see the YouTuber's name so right here like at London Nugs and then you'll see the type of thumbnail clickbait style and then you'll see the original thumbnail from YouTube right here and then underneath it this is what i was able to create without having to do any editing at all so all of these images that you see that say mine this is just from the single prompt underneath right here so you can copy this prompt just like that and you can come over to google's ai studio and create these thumbnails completely for free so i'm going to show you in real time how to do this right now so if i just come over to youtube right now so this video right here this is the thumbnail if i click on the thumbnail i can just download the thumbnail just like that now that i downloaded that thumbnail i'm going to come over here to google ai studio so just type in google ai studio and when you click Click it the first thing you want to do is click on chat and then you're gonna put this prompt in if I upload a YouTube thumbnail can you create a detailed prompt in order for me to recreate it with Google's image generator as close as possible and just go ahead and run that prompt and then once it responds to you you'll know that it's ready to go so then all you have to do is upload your thumbnails okay now it says ready when you are please upload your thumbnail so I'm just gonna click on this plus sign right here and click on upload file and then if I go to my downloads I'll just open that thumbnail right there and i'm gonna upload that thumbnail and now google's chat is going to give me a detailed prompt in order for me to recreate this thumbnail so i'm just gonna wait for it to create that prompt and then i'm just gonna take that over to the image generator portion it says the master prompt highest detail this prompt combines all elements for the most accurate recreation all right so i'm gonna copy that prompt now i'm gonna come over here to where it says generate media on the left i'm gonna click on imagine and then i'm just going to paste that prompt in and also on the right hand side don't forget to check 16 by 9 aspect ratio for youtube thumbnails and then i'm just going to run that prompt and we're going to see how close we're able to get it it's okay but it's not exactly like this one right here so we would have to add in some stuff so this is a good starting point you just really need to be very detailed so i would definitely have to add in that it says chat gpt up here so let me add that in and see if i can get it any closer and i would also make sure that i can say that it's a macbook so that you get that logo on the macbook so let me just go ahead and add that in this is all just off of prompting so guys make sure you download my thumbnail prompt book and hopefully it'll give you a great starting point as you can see i have all different types of styles you can see how closely i was able to get these thumbnails and like I said, I don't do any editing or anything like that on these thumbnails. This is all off of one single prompt, but just using Google AI Studio, the free AI Studio, you can create these thumbnails. So download that, click that link down below, download it. Like I said, if you don't want to pay anything, just type in zero right here. And um, yeah, you guys can get that thumbnail prompt book and hopefully it helps you guys create these different st style thumbnails. It'll give you a good starting point and then you could just plug in different things wherever you want to change it up a little bit um this is a really really cool style jack resider and as you can see i was able to get mine very similar to his without doing any editing or anything like that so i think you guys can create some really good quality thumbnails using this tool i will see you in the next video i hope it helps peace